Hi. Anyway, uh, how many of us have uh, been reeling in and get hooked uh, on the bottom and say, ah, damn, a snag again. And you pull and pull and uh, you either break your line or you come up with a stick or something or, you know, or just an old piece of rock, a piece of wood. Well, I uh, wasn't cursing this snag anyway. Um, <laughs> pretty unique how I got it. I just cast it out there. Just want to pull back in the tension on the rod and uh, anyway, felt felt the pull. I thought it was a fish. But then it let go. And uh, anyway. Anyway, this is what I caught. It's the 820th car that was ever registered in Prince Edward Island, Canada. It's the plate off it. Anyway, probably dates back to about 1910. Or probably right around that area because I was doing a little research on it. Not much, research, not much uh, history on it there, but this is pure prior World War One. So anyway, so so anyway, it's uh, before World War One. So it is in half decent shape for the year. And look at the steel. Not like the cheap stuff you get today. No, you can't even bend it. Look. Ugh. So anyway, so pretty good. So anyway, so yeah. So uh, that's probably my best catch of the year. So, oh, so anyway. It's, Prince Edward Island, Canada, and uh, that's the plate. And uh, Prince Edward on Canada, Prince Edward Island, is the birthplace of Canada. So uh, the first vehicles will probably be here, or one of the top first ones anyway. So that was car eight twenty here. So that's how they did it back then. Just they did it by numbers of what car you were registered by, and they go till there's eight eight hundred nineteen before then. So I was pretty impressed with that catch. Probably my best catch this year. All right. Thanks for watching.